All right, good morning, class. Uh, today we'll be doing an activity um, with you guys where you'll be getting in small groups. Um, we'll get more into it in a second, but we're gonna be going over the five different regions within Africa. Uh, that is the goal for today. Um, we will have you guys count off into five different groups, so we'll have you count by ones. Uh, you'll be paired with your group numbers, ones with ones, twos with twos, and so on. Um, each group number will be associated with a particular region within Africa. Um, so if you look on our class websites, you guys will go here once when you guys get work time. Uh, group one, for example, will be doing Central Africa. So if you click on the link, you'll be taken to uh, this website, the New World Encyclopedia, where you can find a bunch of information about Central Africa, about its uh, geography, history, and some of the things that went on there. Um, using the graphic organizer that I handed out to you guys just a second ago, um, you will use this to go through this website and find this information. So in the middle of it, you'll write your uh, region. So for me, you put down Central Africa, and then you will look for the types of geography within the region, um, the countries, what type of landforms are there, and then any type of interesting facts such as demographics, animals, stuff like that will go in here. Uh, from there, you guys will prepare yourselves to teach your peers um, in different groups um, before that. So before we get started, let's have you guys start off by counting by ones uh, to five, and then we'll put you guys into your groups. Okay, class, I've been walking around and I'm noticing that uh, a few groups are wrapping up. Um, I just want to make sure that the entire class and your entire group uh, completely fills out the graphic organizer, because what we're going to do now is to teach the rest of the class uh, what we learned based on what region uh, you were assigned. Um, so I'm going to ask each group to count off by fives, the same as we did last time. And you're going to then uh, break off into your groups and you're going to teach your other four classmates about your specific region. And we're going to do that until everyone's finished and then we're going to come back together for a large group discussion. All right, everybody. So it's been a while now for you guys to um, kind of share within your groups. Now I just want to pull everything back together. Uh, we're going to have a little uh, class discussion within your groups, uh, more like a think pair share. Um, so right now, I just want to want you guys to kind of think about what you all, all what was talked about, um, and answer a few of these questions within your group. Uh, some examples right here. Think about while doing this activity, what kind of stood out to you in learning this new information. Uh, what types of landforms kind of stood out to you that you could remember even before doing this activity, and also. Um, why were the, why were the landforms kind of formed the way they were? And also, does any of this affect human and or animal life? Anything that you learn about in this activity does it affect animal life in, with, around, in the surroundings? Um, also, see if you can kind of uh, think about other questions that you might have. Also, so I'll give you a few minutes to kind of discuss, and we'll start sharing in a few minutes. Alrighty.